Good morning. <clears throat> it's 5.32. Come on, buddy, let's go. On the 25th of July. And it's, uh, I forgot the temperature. Let's see if I can get the temperature here. Sixty-five degrees. <sighs> Sunrise is at five oh eight, and I was up for that. And uh, sunset's at eight oh eight. So what is that? Twelve, fifteen hours of sunlight. Yeah. I uh, don't have my gloves on. I was going to duck into the barn to find where I left them, but I think I'm going to wait. Uh, oh Yesterday was more of a uh, recovery day from mowing on. What did they mow? Today's Tuesday. Did they mow on Saturday or Sunday? I can't remember. Ah, boy. Anyway, nothing on the game cameras overnight, but there was a a doe uh, between 7 and 8 p.m. yesterday. <laughs> oh, I did uh, put some uh, bat silhouettes on the bat houses. I mounted one of the bat houses down on the utility pole near the house. <coughs> And I played around with the tenon cutter. I had previously tried using the tenon cutter on a less than one inch piece of wood, pre branch. And uh, I did not work so well because the tenon cutter tended to move around. <clears throat> so here's the bigger branch yesterday. Here we go, Flynn. Here we go. And that seems to work. Works nicely. There's something in the road up there. That bird. We're going, we're going south. Let's go north, Flynn. Flynn. Let's go this way. Come. Flynn. There's more mosquitoes down in the, uh, down that bottom of the hill there. Seems to be damper. Cooler. <clears throat> oh. Actually, I wanted to walk down that way. There was some, uh, there's a large birch, not large, but I guess six inch diameter. First, it comes down 
from the uh, snow last year that I had cut up to get out of the road. And uh, I was going to move it. I was going to bring a battery operated chainsaw down there to cut it down a little bit to get it to fit in the back of the gator. But uh, it was too hot. Excuse me. So I just uh, moved it a little bit closer to the road. And maybe I'll get to it today. Although today is Rita's sewing day. I'm thinking about taking the scoot taking the scooter out for a ride. The uh, scooter is a 1983 Honda V65 Magna, also known as the VF 1100C. It's registered and insured. Uh, just have to dig it out of the back of the barn, check the tire pressures. Top off the gas and uh, see if she starts up. I don't know what the weather's supposed to be like today. The uh, sun's been up for about a half hour, but with the uh, the fog, I don't know whether we got cloudy skies or just foggy skies. And the sun's got a deer fly. Scoping them out. I don't think we've seen any hairs yet today. Well, I did have the drone out yesterday. And uh, charged all the batteries up. Sent one of the, one of the freshly charged batteries up. Blew up to over Jenny's house. Got up to uh, 396 feet. Which is uh, four feet shy of the legal limit. <coughs> See if I can pull up some of the pictures and interject them into the uh, the video this morning.
Thank you, my bud. See you. Thank you. Oh, I just realized I took the coffee off the burner. And I forgot to put it back on. It didn't finish percolating. But it was still going pretty aggressively, so I have to take it off just to slow it down. That's my mistake. Potholes are really bad for this time of year. Might be a trail there, my dear. But these do you do see a lot of deer tracks up in this area? <clears throat> Blake, come on, keeps wrapping around me. <sighs> so here we are, coming up to Prentice Township. I think it's also called Princess Plantation, but I had to check. <clears throat> Random rock on the brother. Middle of the road. Some bird droppings on the ground. He's got to mark his territory. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, three, two, and four hundred, three, six hundred feet. Get up to the uh, apprentice town line. Turn around, bud. Nice little breeze. Look, come on. Back to the house. Let's go. Uh. Oh boy. Actually, I had woken up at, uh, I guess, quarter after four. Nature called and I answered. I thought it was quarter to five. So I was going to in bed for a while. Finally get up at uh, five o'clock.
Так, чума. Ну что? Lane, come on. So I wear a uh, Samsung watch, and uh, my daily goal is 6,000 paces, and yesterday I exceeded that, I guess because of the uh, trips I made between the barn and the house, and walking Flynn, It's uh, around 200 feet from the house at the barn. And I walk back and forth several times, carrying the birdhouse, the bat houses, tools to mount the bat house to the pole. Oh, but. I think my highest, highest daily pace count was around 19,000 paces, steps, whatever you want to call them, uh, probably two Octobers ago when I was out hunting. Well, it was probably November. So particular. <clears throat> well, I can feel the dampness in the air. Whenever he walks through the brush like this, he's looking for a place to relieve himself. <clears throat> he's got to go all the way to the end of the leash. Looks like it's going to be a nice day. Okay, he's done.
I'm going to try to hold the high res camera down low so you can get Flynn's perspective. <clears throat> Yesterday would have been a great day to have the boat out, but We just still need to get some non-slip shoes. Last time we were out, she had Crocs on. When they got wet, they were extremely slippery. starting to burn through the haze. starting to burn through over here. I think I, uh, before I flew the drone yesterday, there's an app on uh, my phone, or actually on the iPad, that checks conditions, how much wind there is, and How many satellites are being picked up? And the wind was only four miles an hour, which is nice. And you can see the sun burning through here. <clears throat>
Glenn, Glenn. Come here. Come here. Stay, stay. I think I got him. That's going to be it for today. I'll let you know tomorrow whether I got the scooter out or not. Oh, we got to check out the bad house. Come over here. Come. Come. Right in that tree. There's the bad house. The other two that I made have a single large bat silhouette on them. Then come. Let's come. Now that I've succeeded in getting my shoes wet, I'm gonna walk on the grass to not collect a bunch of gravel and track it in the house. Alright. Hi, bud. Let's go get you treats. Thanks for watching.